This is part three of setting up your site in Revit using a surveyor's uh, DWG drawing. Okay, in the previous tutorial, uh, part number two, we've set up the contours, so we've now got actual proper uh, surveyed levels in our drawing. Okay, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to um, get our coordinates set up correctly. Okay, the way we do that when you get a surveyor's drawing, it will give you longitude and latitude coordinates. Okay, what we've now got to do is we've got to set up our drawing so that the drawing will reflect those uh, longitude and latitude coordinates. You do that by going to manage <coughs> coordinates, um, specific, specify coordinates at point. Okay, so what we're going to do, let's first go to this one here. <coughs> okay, if you, are, if you are in South Africa, it is very important to know that because we are on the southern side of the equator, we've got to put a minus in front. Okay, so you've got to remember to put a minus. You will then put that figure in, which is three six four two zero 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 and you always have to add three zeros at the end I'm not exactly sure why but that's how it works one two three and okay okay we're gonna do the same over here but this time we've got to put a positive in front. Okay, we select that. We're going to go positive six two four zero zero, and three noughts at the end. Okay, so let's just check that that's correct. Let's go to this line. The best way to check is to go to annotations and spot coordinate and to actually see if that coordinate is correct which it is okay let's just go down here let's get another coordinate going that one is correct and if we go to this one There we go, and I'm not going to be able to snap on it perfectly, but our coordinates are set up correctly. Okay, so now any point on the drawing where you spot a coordinate that would actually give you the proper GPS coordinate of that point on your site. You can then give those coordinates to the builder. Um, if he's got a GPS device, he can set the building out uh, by using those. And that is the end of part three. I hope this helps.